Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Metroid Fusion. So, if you remember in the last one, yeah, we came face to face with Nightmare, and uh, yeah, it didn't go so well. Also, this is kind of the same night that I'm recording, so yeah, basically all that stuff that happened before with the, uh, you know the guy. Yeah, it's, it still happened. So, I'm still kind of upset. I've managed to calm down after watching it, looking back in the same video again. I think it's okay. But, again, that still doesn't count for me actually feeling, uh, actually feeling better about what happened. Come on, and get out of the way. But yeah, um, we're gonna try to beat this guy again. Like, I, I haven't, uh, um, besides that other shoddy display that you just saw, I actually do remember how to fight him. It, it, it just took me that one time to actually figure out the, uh, the correct strategy again. And I'm not just saying that just to kind of save face, but yeah, it actually has been a long time since I played my trick, so you can say. Most of the stuff I kind of don't remember, but, uh, yeah. Yep. So you have to, like, give me a few tries so I can actually get it back going again. But now, I think I actually do know how to beat him. First thing to do is just to actually get there. And to get there shouldn't take that long at all. Okay. So the thing I was trying to do first was shoot his face, but that's not what you do first. You, you're supposed to shoot his little uh, gravity tool with either charge shots or missiles. I would say missiles because it's faster right now. But, uh... After that, then, uh... Yeah, see, he's gonna start doing that now. So now we actually try to, uh... Use our boom. Until it breaks. So until it breaks, don't stop shooting it. You have to ah, dang it. You have to worry about this. I wish I could just get my jumps right. Okay. Oh, what? No. Oh. Oh, where are you coming from? Okay. okay. Keep firing, keep firing, keep firing, keep firing, keep firing, come on. Yeah, there you are. Um, just look how nasty this thing looks. Come on. Ouch. Move. Okay. And now we have to grab this seat. So now we don't have to worry about all that stupid gravity control or walking through water anymore. Now we're okay. So this might be insignificant, it may not be like an exact weapon or anything, but the gravity suit is probably like one of my uh, favorite power-ups in terms of uh, 
in terms of power-ups in Metroid ever. Because it's just... I don't know, just, just not being able to be slow in places that you would normally be slow in. It's like, probably one of my favorite things to not have to worry about. Okay. So. Got that. Now we can try to get out of here. So, if you guys kind of remember already. I think we go this way. Oh, what? Did I mess that up? Ah, more spear attack. Okay, we, we did mess that up. Hold on. Oh, come on. I can make that. I'm not just saying it either. I mean, I can actually make that. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's another water spot. So, yeah, that, that, that's one of the things I don't like about water levels either. It's just, I don't know, it's mainly calm right now. I mean, it's not... Okay, let me grab that. But yeah, it's, it's not calm right now because, of course, it's, it's like kind of new and everything. So you just kind of want to explore as much as you want to, but the, uh, if you, if you're like stuck in that spot for a while, and you, and you just hear all this, and you haven't been able to move like anywhere else, yeah, this, this is kind of going to get on your nerves. Okay. I'll tell you what, another thing that gets on my nerves, and you that keep reappearing after you hit them. I mean, it's fine in some games, but games like this, eh, not so much. Oh, it, uh, well, this is completely off topic because it's not doesn't have anything to do with Metroid. But uh, I don't know. Uh, do you guys like warrior games? Like, uh, Dynasty Warriors and Samurai Warriors. Do you like it at all? Like, that's kind of one of my favorite genres, where you just keep fighting, like, chords of enemies like that. Some people don't like it. But, uh, for me, I kind of do. It's, like, one of my favorite things to do ever. And, uh, I don't know. I just find it really fun. Go on, get out of here. But yeah, the reason why I brought, bring that up is because I had this idea, but I don't know. I don't think a lot of people like too much liked it. But I'm gonna see what you guys say, I guess. Uh, what do you think? If there was like a Super Mario Warriors game. Like, do you suppose that could work? I mean, sometimes I don't think I don't think it would. Well people don't think it would when I ask. But I don't know. I mean it seems pretty fun, and there's like a lot of, uh... There's like a lot of enemies that, uh... That you can beat up. And Super Mario that could just be used as, uh... As regular enemies, you know? Like, you still have, like, the, uh... The hordes of Goombas and Koopas and all that other stuff. And I don't know. I kinda think it I kinda think it will. But, uh, yeah, most people keep saying, like, it, it doesn't work and should probably just give up on it, but I don't know. I'd rather like the idea. Okay. Let's 
you unlock security room four. I think it, yeah, okay, security level four. So I don't know. I, I'm thinking we're not supposed to do that, but we do it anyway because who cares about authority? We do what we want to. But, uh, yeah. Let's keep going with this. See where it takes us. Whoops. Hold on a minute. I messed that up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You'll, you'll see what I mean in a bit. Okay. Yeah. Those two things moving up on the ceiling. The X parasites are supposed to go to those. And then once, once they hit those... Yeah, then we kill all the enemies in the room, which causes this door right here to open. Okay, and we got another energy tank. So that's not bad. We're getting a lot of items, which is good. Let's see. Where else do we need to go? Okay, we were going straight up, so let's keep going up there. Kind of feels strange, like all the... Now we got all the doors open now. Now we can go wherever the heck we want to go. But we're going to keep going to the right. Ahem. <laughs> um. Uh. I wonder if I should play and I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll get to that part. We'll, uh. We'll get to it. Well, well, when we get to that part, we'll see what happens. But, uh. Ah, hit my hand again. Okay. Ah, let me up here. I think power bombs actually keep you from, uh... Oh, what? Why is that there? Oh. Let's see if we can get by here like this. Okay. Okay, we can't get up there because he blows up too much. Okay, and that's broken right there, so... Wait a minute. I know what to do. I just don't care about using my missiles. I use them if I want to. Okay. So I think we started up far enough. So we can hit that. Go down here. Go through this door. Hup. Come on. Okay, there we go. Is there anything up here? Ah, uh, okay. There wasn't anything of value anyway. I see a data room down there. We might want to get that data. See what happens. What's here? Ah, the diffusion. So now... Well, we'll, t we'll test it out in the other room. You'll, you'll, you'll see how it works. So here's how diffusion works. It, you charge it up with R, and then when you release it... See, now now your, uh, your ice missiles have like a spread shot to it. So now when you charge up and release, you can still, like, do basically what your, uh... I guess what your power bomb does, except for freezing on it, so that's not too bad. 
Anyway, let's save. Uh, navigation room. You upgraded your missiles? That's unusual. There was no word from HQ, a procedural error, I'm sure. Even so, I did not approve of bypassing security level 4, but not only will you use more discretion. In any case, Samus, do you remember the security robot you faced earlier? I believe the X infected it. That is to say, they have claimed the organic components that form its neural network as entrance sector 6 not. I don't know what it's playing, but let's not wait to find out. Samus, you know what to do. So already right then, it's kind of suspicious because you think, like, if the, uh... Of the uh, the Federation cared about what Samus is dealing with right then, they wouldn't care about like uh, like whether or not she got another upgrade or not. Because it's like, well, yeah, the X is dangerous. You need to you need to stay safe. So even if they did send it in error, you know, it would be like, oh, well, she can still use it though, right? So that's always like something you could keep an eye out for, brother. Dude, I already know where it is. Alright, the security robot seems to have gotten much stronger. This worries me. Be careful. But we have another problem. Once you're done, leave not immediately. The Samus X is tracking you. Don't stay longer than you should, understood? Okay. Let's save it. And we already got all the missiles and power bombs that we need, so let's keep going from there. Um, let me see. Is there anything I need to blow up here? Okay, I can't get that. I want it, but I cannot get it unless I lay a power bomb here. And then I can get this. And then we can leave. So where do we need? Oh, well, it's not marked. I'm guessing we just need to go straight down. If I had to, if I had to make assumptions. Oh, did I get it or no? Aha! There we go. So, yeah. Always good to use those power bombs. Do not be afraid of not being able to get more of them. You will. If you need more power bombs, just go to a data room or. If you're on the main deck, just go back to your ship. Your ship will restore your health and your uh, ammunition. So do not worry about that. Just keep going. Uh, let's see. Now, where are we supposed to go here? Oh, this is the room that we couldn't go to. Let me see. Okay, we can still keep going. So let's go down. Get out of the way. And I'm pretty sure that's where the robot is. Like back there. But uh... He was a safe station. Okay. I don't know if we should keep going because it's like... I don't know. I mean, it's a minute. Let's we'll, we'll, we'll see where. Let's we'll see what kind of mess we can get into from there. Gotta be somewhere, right? Oh, okay. So we can't get out of the station. I think that might have awakened our giant friend there. But you know what? Let's kind of cut it just a few seconds short. You know? I say if I take more time and get to the time that we need, but uh... Okay, let's save it right here. Now in the next episode, I think we're going to fight the security robot, so I'll see you then.